finish him. Hey everyone, this is Digital Charcuterie. If you're new here, click that subscribe button. We got videos all the time. We are a charcuterie board of digital content. And if you like this video, use fatality on that like button. Let's get right to it. Carl Urban from The Boys from Star Trek from Dread is in final talks. Final negotiations to join Mortal Kombat 2, the sequel to the 2021, as Johnny Cage. Johnny Cage, of course, was not in that first movie, but was teased heavily towards the end. And in the post credit scene, we saw that our new hero, Cole, was going to L.A. And we see a poster for Johnny Cage, and that means he's got to come into it. Johnny Cage was in the first Mortal Kombat game way, way back in 1992. Gotta bring him in. He's a fan favorite. People were disappointed he wasn't in it. I was a little bit disappointed, but watching the movie, you understood he didn't have a place in the film. He was one of the best parts of the 90s movie. And then, of course, killed off really quickly in Mortal Kombat Annihilation, a severely underrated film. It's fun AF. Watch it. It is such it is a gas, man. It's like it's ridiculous. I love I have a soft spot for Mario Brothers Street Fighter. Well, common and of course, Double Dragon. Those movies are so much fun. It's just so freaking ridiculous. Uh, and this now is coming from. So the sequel will be, of course, same director as the first one, Simon McQuad, and it's going to be written by the writer of Moon Knight, and it's going to start shooting in Australia between June and September this year. That's Jeremy Slater writing the sequel. Slater spoke to the direct and said the following: "I don't think it's necessarily going to have the same tone as the MCU, but it's definitely going to have some of my sensibilities." That was part of my pitch. To them. This is Mortal Kombat. We have guys who are ripping off their faces and breathing fire. It's a weird universe. Let's embrace some of that weirdness and let's make a Mortal Kombat sequel that no one is expecting and that can kind of sneak in and blow everyone away. We're still really early in that process, but I'm having a blast writing the script. I very much enjoyed Mortal Kombat 1. I thought some of the dialogue was a little cheesy. The story was kind of all over the place, but it was fun. I don't think it was as good as the 90s, the first Mortal Kombat in the 90s, but it was, you know, it was definitely a, a step up from the sequel which like I said I have a soft spot, soft spot for. I'm really curious what they're going to do because even with that movie being what it was it had the potential to break off and be something even better going forward. Uh, so let's see man if they're going to embrace the weird who could they what could that mean? Could they embrace some of the characters like Meat? Can we see Meat or Baraka or Devora show up? Someone weird going to show up that's so off the radar you're like oh yeah and then make that character a fan favorite. Carl Urban in talks. That's cool. He's a great actor. Could be great at the role as Johnny Cage. He's got the attitude, the swagger. Let's see what we got. I'm looking forward to Mortal Kombat. Are you? Let me know in the comments down below. Any characters you'd like to see pop up in the sequel? Let me know. And until next time, may you be the master of your own universe.